So obviously this um, light fixture came with the house. I have updated it once because um, it used to have like like beigey glass globes on it. And even years ago, I just got these little um, shades to put on it just to kind of make it a little bit more, um, I don't know, aesthetically pleasing, I guess. The problem is that we can't change this light fixture ourselves because <laughs> the it connects, like that's like two stories up. There's no way Michael's gonna hire someone to change that. <laughs> it's just not who he is. So I have to figure out a way to like modify the actual light and make it look good. You guys see where I'm going with this? How about now? Is it starting to look like a lampshade? <laughs> onto something um, as I sit here on the floor in Lowe's but I'm in the plumbing section and I found these pieces uh, it has an extra piece that I don't really need like why can't both ends have holes in them satisfied with it though and I think I might redo it um, my concept was great the execution needed a little bit of help and I think I know how to fix it so as you can see it's like a little bit wonky like on this side you can see how like it goes in right there um, it's just this is probably the best angle of it <laughs> So once again, before I had those thin metal rods that I kind of like screwed in here so that I could, you know, continuously wrap everything and it wouldn't impact my, the wrapping. So now with these, they'll keep everything stable. So as I'm wrapping it, nothing moves. It stays like in the right form. However, once I, when I get to each of these, I'm gonna have to like unscrew them and rescrew them back in, which sucks. But honestly, I mean, it's like a two second thing. So um, so yeah, hopefully this goes better and I don't end up with a wonky shape like I did last time. And then obviously
feel it might be officially time for me to accept defeat with this slight project, at least the way that I was envisioning for it to turn out. Um, so I hung it up and it was like nice and all the strings were tight and it still was just, it just ends up being wonky where... So I unscrewed like everything that was pull, holding the braces that were holding this bottom ring so that it was all taut um, because it was just, I don't know how to describe it, it was just jacked up. So you can kind of see like how, it's just hard to keep all of the rings like stacked perfectly on top of each other. So even with all the bracing and everything that I did, it just did. So for me, in order for me to take out this outside ring right here, for it to be drapey, like, I need to, if I, I can't just take it out because there's a bunch of stuff that's connected inside here. So I need to kind of figure that out. But if I can get it to where this is like loose, like right here, and it's just like drape and drape, it might look okay. Ugh, this is mentally exhausting. <laughs> I do like the lighter color. Um, oh God. It's just... This thing is going to be the bane of my existence. Since we're doing like the drapey thing, I think I'm going to try to unscrew the bottom part of these and screw it into this inner ring and then I'm gonna get rid of this ring I don't know how that's gonna work we're gonna have to see and but that sucks because it also means I've got to like take apart this this part which is it's not terrible I just have, it'll just be a little bit difficult to get in there to unscrew it but I can work it out Okay, so I took out the bottom ring and took out the outer ring for the top tier. So, and so now I'm going to secure it on the inside here, which will bring it up and then kind of leave everything a little drapey. Hopefully it works. I think it'll work. I have faith. So not so funny story, but this is the moment when my hands were full with the new and improved light shade that Michael decided to ask me why I was doing all of this work, weeks and weeks of work, instead of just buying a new light fixture. And he is the one who told me 10 years ago when we first moved in that we couldn't replace the light fixture without hiring someone to put scaffolding up. Now he tells me, at that moment that we actually could have replaced a light fixture. We didn't have to replace the whole chain. We could have just bought a new light and attached it to the end of the existing cord and existing chain. Again, for the record, this is not what he told me 10 years ago. And if my hands hadn't been full, I would have strangled him. <laughs> <laughs>